Hello friends, welcome back. In this quick video, we are going to learn how to install Spring Boot CLI on Windows machine. So it's gonna be quick. Just go to google.com and type Spring Boot CLI. Click the very first link, which is the official website of Spring Boot or Spring. Now here, just click here on the getting started HTML. It's hyperlink. Just click here. Now here you see there are different versions for manual session. What do we have? There are different options. So basically we are using Windows machine. So I'll just go and download the very first link, which is Spring Boot CLI bin dot zip file. Okay, so I'm just going to download this on my desktop. So just to wait for this to happen, I think it's uh, quick. Okay, I have here. Now next thing is I'm just going to extract Spring Boot CLI Okay, I'm just going to install this one on my on root of C drive actually C Okay Let's go and verify whether we have this one C Spring Boot Okay, here Spring 2.2.2 release so I'll just go and rename this one for simplicity spring boot CLI 2.2 or I'll call it so I'm just renaming it for my convenience it is not required okay so the next thing is we need to set up an element variable so that we can make use of CLI from anywhere in this machine so go to properties advanced system settings java i go and click here or i'll just add in the path here and sorry control z so in the end i'll put cli path bin okay 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 i'll just close this one and just to verify whether we are good with the cli I'll just go and type here what should I spring dash dash version of oh, sorry the command is incorrect spring dash dash version so here you can see right spring CLI version 2.2.2 is successfully installed so we have configured spring CLI on the Windows machine now we can make use of the CLI to create projects and to do a lot more that we'll discuss in the coming video so the, the target or the agenda of this video was to install a Spring Boot CLI, CLI on the machine. So what we did is simply went to the official website of Spring.io and we downloaded the zip file. The next task was to unzip this folder Spring Boot on the root of C drive. So that is what we did here. here. And then next step was to set up the environment variable until here. C Spring Boot CLI and then bin. So I just copy the path and we set up one environment environment variable. So I put the value inside the path variable in the end of path variable here. Here, yeah, that's it. So simple and so quick. So I just exit from here. I think that's it for this video, guys. We have configured or installed Spring Boot CLI on Windows machine successfully thank you for watching